Today we will discuss the histology slides points of identification of circulatory system. Elastic artery or large artery. Elastic artery has three layers: tunica intima, tunica media, and tunica adventitia. The tunica intima it is relatively thick and consists of endothelium, subendothelial layer of connective tissue, and internal elastic lamina. The subendothelial layer of connective tissue is well developed and consists of both collagen and elastic fibers. The internal elastic lamina is not so conspicuous. Tunica media. It is the thickest of the three layers with presence of many elastic lamina between the smooth muscle cell layers. The external elastic lamina is non-differentiable. Tunica adventitia. It is relatively a thin layer of connective tissue which is less than half the thickness of the tunica media and consists of collagen fibers, elastic fibers which are less organized than those in the tunica media, fibroblasts, macrophages and vesa vesorum. Muscular or medium sized artery. Muscular artery has also three layers. Tunica intima. It is relatively thinner than in elastic arteries. It consists of endothelium, sparse amount of subendothelial layer and a prominent internal elastic lamina which is thrown into wavy folds. Tunica media. It is thick with presence of many smooth muscle fibers with very little elastic fibers. Presence of external elastic lamina, which has high concentration of elastic fibers adjacent to the tunica media. Tunica adventitia. It is relatively thick and consists of fibroblasts, collagen, and elastic fibers. Arteriole. Arteriole has three layers. Tunica intima. It consists of endothelium, subendothelial layer, and internal elastic lamina, which is poorly developed. Tunica media consists of 1 to 3 layers of smooth muscle cells. External elastic lamina is absent in most of the arterioles. Tunica adventitia is thin and ill defined and consists of loose connective tissue and few nerve fibers only. Let us now see the various differences between the elastic artery, muscular artery, and arteriole. First, in the tunica intima, in elastic artery, consists of endothelium, subendothelial layer of connective tissue and has ill-defined internal elastic lamina. In muscular artery, the subendothelial layer of connective tissue is sparse and it has a well-defined internal elastic lamina. In arteriole, the subendothelial layer and the internal elastic lamina both are poorly developed. In tunica media of elastic artery, many elastic lamina and few smooth muscle fibers are present. In muscular artery, it consists of many layers of smooth muscle cells and a prominent external elastic lamina. In arteriole, it consists of 1 to 3 layers of smooth muscle cells. The tunica adventitia of elastic artery is a thin layer and contains vasa vesorum. In muscular artery, it is relatively thick layer as compared to elastic artery and vasa vesorum are not so prominent. In arteriole, it is thin and ill-defined. Vein. It is thin walled and large collapsed lumen. The tunics of the veins are not as well defined as the tunics of the arteries. The tunica intima consists of endothelium, a thin subendothelial layer, and in some cases a thin internal elastic lamina. Tunica media it is a thin layer with few smooth muscle fibers and less collagen and elastic fibers. Tunica adventitia, it is typically thicker than the tunica media and consists of collagen fibers and elastic fibers. Now have a look on the differences between the artery and the vein. In artery the wall is thick, in vein the wall is thin. In artery the lumen is patent and in vein the lumen is collapsed. In artery the internal elastic lamina is well defined and in vein it is not seen. In artery, the tunica media contains elastic fibers and smooth muscle in much larger quantity compared to vein. In vein, it consists of collagen and smooth muscle cells. In artery, the tunica media is thicker than the adventitia. In vein, the tunica media is thinner than the adventitia. In artery, the tunica adventitia is made up of connective tissue. 
In vein, the tunica adventitia is made up of smooth muscle and elastic fibers. In artery, all the three coats are well differentiated. In vein, they are not so well defined.